Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today's question is Invert Binary Tree. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. The question says, we are given with a binary tree and we need to invert it. So suppose we are given with 4, 2, 7, 1, 3, 6, 9. We need to invert it. That means I need to convert 9 into 6, 3 into 1, then 7 into 2 and root will remain the same. So this is supposed to be our output. So let's move on to pen and paper. Let's see how we can solve this question. After that, we will see the code. The question is asking that we need to invert the given binary tree. And how we need to invert it? That the left child of the root will become the right child and the right child of the root will become the left child. And same goes on till the leaf node. First of all, we are swapping the child of 2. So we are swapping 3 and 1. We are swapping 6 and 9. Then we are swapping 7 and 2. So if you look at it clearly, so what we are simply doing here is we are starting from leaf node. We swap the left child and the right child. In this way, we move upward. So we will solve this question using recursion. So for that, we need to have a base case. And what is our base case? Once I am in the leaf node, we don't have to do anything. So if root is none, written none. So this is our base case. Else what we are doing here, we will use our same function again, our recursive function. So whatsoever is the name, suppose invert tree, we will run it on root dot right and we will run it on root dot left. That will going to convert the nodes. Once we have swapped nodes, after that I will assign my root dot right equal to left and my root dot left equal to right. And at the end I can simply return root. So this is what we are doing here. First of all, I am taking care of swapping of these two, then these two, and at the end, I am returning root. So this was a fairly easy question. So let's move on to coding part and let's see what is the code for this problem. So at line number 9, I defined my base case. If root is none, I will return none. Then I am using my recursive function on the left and the right. Then I am simply putting my root dot right equal to equal to recursive function on left and root dot left equal to recursive function on right. In this way, I am swapping or you can say inverting the whole tree and at the end, I am simply returning root. So let's check whether it works or not. So here I submitted my code and it got accepted. So this was the solution for this problem. You can find the code in the description below. If this video was helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much guys for watching the video. Please don't forget to subscribe.